talking about my practice and really hoping to inspire you. This is very stagey. Uh, to really dedicate yourselves to whatever you you feel that is meaningful for you. Um, So I like to uh, start like defining my practice uh, through a concept called multilatics. You know, I was asked uh, yesterday to say something about like what this lecture is going to be about, and um, one thing that I remember that is pretty relevant to, to me at some point in order to be able to formulate like what is it that I'm doing and why am I doing it that way was that I got a question from a teacher at the conservatory and he asked like why can't you compose about one single thing like why do your things have to be about so many things it's like that's that's confusing, that's uh, disturbing, that's, uh, that's, not, that's not a good thing, that's not what we do here, kind of vibes. So, after I really said that, I was like, this really doesn't make sense for me, because that's not what I want, right? And that's like, that's really far away from whatever I would consider interesting uh, for myself. It's like, of course, like, I really like that there are so many different things in the world and that we can all do different stuff, but like why would I have to do that in order to be like recognized or validated? And why couldn't he understand that actually I have like different values and different priorities and different interests? So I was thinking, okay, I need to I need to understand and be able to explain him or other people because I feel I feel this is actually a thing like I can feel that there are many of my colleagues or the people that I see around that that are trying to fit in one thing like okay this piece is about that I've developed this system or this thing that I want to show you, you no know? and I mean there's nothing wrong with that but I was I was always thinking like why do so many people go that way you know so then it happened that, like, actually, Corona and stuff. And then I, I tried to, to, I tried to like dig more and more into like finding out why I felt like uh, in that way misplaced because that, that this should be some kind of reason. And then I went started looking into this uh, kind of uh, okay, where do I come from? Maybe there's something about like. Brazil, because it's such a mixed place, and uh, there's so much going on, and like, and then I actually found a lot of interesting stuff in like African American thought and like indigenous aesthetics. Like, have you ever thought that, for example, these kind of like uh, rituals, just like uh, indigenous uh, stuff, or like uh, before. Uh, post-industrial uh, division of labor that there was a lot of stuff that was more mixed like the stuff that many people are doing today in a way that like interdisciplinarity or like uh, multi whatever and uh, like uh, all dance with singing with uh, moving with writing with uh, uh, loving with uh, uh, doing like uh, eating or fucking or whatever it's like everything was much more like blurred and I think that's a thing I think that we are trying to divide to conquer but we're not gonna conquer any shit I mean look, look at what's like oh man you're, you're fucking Gen Z I mean you, you're like you know what's going on it's like oh the catastrophe is near oh my god and we're just like watching okay what are we gonna do because I mean we, we, we haven't gone so far and uh, it, this whole thing about I'm a specialist I can do this better than this person you know this this hasn't 
gone too well. I would say like we've developed so much stuff like uh, which is hyper cool like uh, tech and stuff and like uh, whoa life quality in the sense that if you have money you can buy the, your food and shit and and all that and your goods and have like nice isolated warm insulated house shelter here that's pretty important and uh, but like it just created a total disconnection also actually between this whole psychologized idea of like inside and outside like have you ever thought about uh, this thing about like inside myself like what the fuck is that like i mean is it really real like do you really think that our cells like happen inside us i think that's just one of the key questions you know like when when this whole uh, idea of like the individual started because what i found out is that this kind of cultures that are left behind and like massacred and and that had to like fucking struggle everywhere to survive like with the you know forced diaspora like yeah it's not only black people but like so many people it's like Arabs and and Jews and well, whatever it's like it's there is so much stuff under the surface and uh, and these people usually if you look closer you, you figure that they have like some very specific ways of connecting to each other and like the the whole individual like i am a solid unit it has a different meaning it's like it's not it's not that solid you know you 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 actually more conscious and more elaborated uh, about the way that you are hyper connected to other people and the way you actually can play with that you know you can play with the circumstances you can play with the fact that okay now there is a stage here and there is a lot of tools and a lot of stuff that is actually there already and also with each other you know it's like when you see a musician when you meet a performer when you meet a, a festival director when you meet whoever like your mother or something you know this person has a history this person has a background this person has desires this person has repressions this person has uh, conflicts this person has what we call contradictions which would just be like in my opinion a huge complexity instead of like lots of opposite things to each other because there is this thing the whole idea of the individual you know it's like one uh, i am inside and you're outside you know it's like i is me inside and this is me 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 and this is you 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 know where like if you allow yourself so you're going to see that this border is much more fluid and there's so much stuff in there that is not explored there's so much stuff in there that has been like delegated to garbage because oh we should know exactly we should know exactly where the border is where the limit is so was like the border between the country the border between me and you my limits your limits you know it's like oh we're in this relationship and the most important thing is like i have to preserve myself my limits and your limits and yes of course we have and now you know and, and uh, like our oppressed people and like uh, indigenous people and black people and, and women and queer and like trans and all, all those things you know of course there is this impetus you know this is me and i'm gonna be myself and i'm gonna assume myself but i mean the whole play it actually it doesn't happen there you know this is like a survival mechanism we shouldn't limit ourselves to live on the basis of a survival mechanism i mean the survival mechanism is the one that says okay here is a bottle and there is water inside it you know and i'm going to drink it and i know all those concepts and i know what water is and i expect that water is clean and i expect that it's going to go into my body you know and feed me and fulfill all my necessity of hydration this is like okay this is what i need to survive you know but there's like so much beyond that that is like more complex and more abstract and more blurred So I'm, I'm really here to talk about the, this nomadism, you know, this nomadic 
way of experiencing things and of like offering an aesthetic experience because we're, we're I think we're tired. I think we're tired. We're tired of of being told what to do. I've been told that you know this is what you you should go and you should do like this because then we're gonna finish the pandemic because then you're gonna be a happy person and then you you know there is you have the things that you need to fulfill and then you know just look at it and start considering it's like how can I bend this how can I bend this in order to have more of what we call agency like consider really the effect because I'm I'm here and I'm affecting you and you're affecting me and I can't ignore that I can't have like a idealized a picture of like my composition. My composition is there, you know, in the world of the ideas, and it's never gonna be that good because my idea is the best. I mean, how fucking old is that? I mean, really, it's like we should get more used to that. There is no, there is no best. There is no best picture. There is like the conditions we have now. There is like me and you who came specifically, you and how you were sitting and connecting and among each other and with me and how what you ate for breakfast 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 oh my god what what, what you ate for breakfast and uh, you know if you if you had your shit or whatever I mean all these things you know it's like it's more real than like you having to think of oh my god that performance wasn't so good and uh, oh it could have been better no we we, we we need to, that's in the now, you know, we can't think like, oh, we're going to fix the world in 50 years, you know, that's, that's, you know, if you just work towards it. And that's also like, hands up for festival, U and M and stuff like that, that's like, okay, let's just like try, let's just like try our best and, and see like, it, can we book a, a more a diverse thing and use like a complex strategy, not like, you know, it's not about, of course it's not about saying, oh, this is the quota, and this is how many people should be, and oh, and there is lacking one, or there is plus two, or oh, I'm not going to be taken because I'm not a part of the dominant class anymore. No, I mean, it's, it's much more complex than that, you know, and, and we know it, and we need to allow ourselves to, to acknowledge that it's complex and it's fine. We don't need to solve, we don't need to solve. There is no solution. There is no solution. There is no solution. It's been so nice for so long. 
think the more you are aware of it as composers, as our responsibility to take care of it. Come on, also care. Fuck, that, I, that's another lecture. It's like care. Care. I mean, it's all about, oh, the world is fucked, apocalypse, everything is shit. The, I like to say the great white weight of, uh, great white way of living is like collapsing, you know. It's, and then the great weight, the great weight for that to happen, the soul of it, the soul of soul weight. It's like, oh, we're just gonna wait. We're gonna just keep up doing our thing, whatever that is. I mean, care, isn't, isn't it, isn't it a super interesting thing, you know, you care, you care for whatever is there, you care for who is there, you know, when I, when I write, I mean, I also say write, what the fuck write, I mean, why, why, do, why do you say, why do you say write pieces, I mean, you can do whatever, you can think pieces, you can act pieces, you can dance pieces, you can punch someone, that's a piece, I'm just gonna punch you, like for, like five minutes, and then you're gonna play your instrument, and that's a fucking piece, you know? It's like, why, why everything has to be so writing-centered? This is so, so much like, you know, Western culture domination. It's like, er this eruditism, there is so much knowledge in all the ways of behaving, and all the ways of communicating, and that's really something that I would like us to explore in a bit, you know? It's like, to have you also to play with it, because we need to play, we're tired. You know, we need to have fucking fun. You know, we're tired of this. We're tired of everything. We're tired also of our own responsibilities and of, of this self thing that is imposed on us. I mean, you know, th there is a better, there, there, is, there, there is a better, more inclusive way of to even thinking ourselves, diversity, you know, through, by way of the, ourselves, the way we think ourselves, the way we behave, the way we allow some things and not, you know? And this care, you know, all this like, oh, inclusion of also like the much more feminine values. It's, there is also this like, but patriarchal uh, oppression also of care, you know, it's like all oh, spiritual ethics of production and of having to be like super productive and like just mechanical production of art, I mean, that's so, that's so absurd, I mean, when we kind of choose, oh, we want to do this thing, we want to create this thing, we want to create this, like, new reality for us and for other people, because that's, that's where I want to live in, you know, that's like, that's why I do this, that's because I believe, we, I, I don't, I don't believe, I trust, because believe, it's like, you believe, you still think, like, you believe, because that's unreal. You only believe in things that are unreal. In things that are real, you trust. I trust. I, it's like, I trust the performance. I trust the situation. I trust. I trust. Because I know that something there that I don't know anything about that is going to manifest itself. You know. So, you, like, tr you care. You care for this, and then you trust. You trust that with your care, like, the first thing that that I do when I start composing a thing for anyone, I mean anyone that is up for a meeting, because I mean maybe like, you know, <laughs> the Danish symphony orchestra wouldn't be up for like a tete a tete, but like, you know, uh, whenever I can, so I, I, I just say, hey, well, let's eat, let's have a cup of coffee, because I need to know what is happening in your life, because if we're doing this together, it's because it should make some kind of fucking sense, you know, in the sense that maybe if, even if it doesn't make sense it's because we want something, we want to be free of sense, you know what I mean? But as long as like we're in this thing together, we kind of need to get a, a feeling of each other. I, I can't just say like, yeah, you, you know, just like this is the thing, the piece is here, it exists there, and then you go here and then you do that, which is gonna be a, you know what I mean? So it's like Meeting each other, we're, we're people. It's, it's time to acknowledge that. I mean, it's, it's time to acknowledge that you, we are humans and we have desires and expectations and uh, you know all, all all the thing, all the package, the whole package, the whole package. That's that's that. 
Yeah, let's try. You know, let's try just not to ignore that. It's, it's easy. It's easy. But it's the most difficult, you know what I mean? It's easy to just put us in boxes and say, okay, I'm the composer, you're a performer, or I'm the woman, you're the man, or whatever. I'm the Brazilian, you're the non Brazilians. Uh, so, I mean, that's, that's too easy, but it ends up being like the most problematic, that's what I call difficult, the most problematic thing, because that's what's gonna give us difficulties. Yes, we're gonna do some of that to survive, you know, but let's just not limit ourselves to that kind of shallow, you know, communication and, and level of creativity, because each, every single arm and foot and, and limb of our contact, our like octopus relationship, you know, with our tentacles, yeah, you, you guys should check out octopuses, you know, like squids, actually. Like deep water squids, you know, what is happening there, the whole play between truth and lies. There is no truth, there is no lie, you know. There's, it's all about seduction. It's all about seduction. It's all about seduction and survival, really. Like, you know, the squids are there, and it's like super, super, super dark. They can't see anything, really. So they send like light signals to each other, and you know, you have seen it somewhere, and, and you know, and it's all about like kind of a play, like kind of deceiving and then calling and sending away and like I'm here but I'm not anymore, you know, and all that. Because I mean, honestly, that's what's happening, you know, especially with the internet. The internet is a fucking deep water, you know, the deep water web, you know. It's like the, the possibility of of what we call lies, which could be just called tales. The tales of the internet. You know, the tales, the whole fake news thing. The tales and the, the whole seduction game, the whole, oh, look how beautiful I look, and, I, and then you go just home and you think, oh man, I just look like shit. <laughs> you know? And that's like all that play, you know, oh, how happy I am, this is my meal, it looks so good. This is my wine. Oh my god. There is this satire on like like white girls' Instagram. Oh my god. It's like, oh, you know, everything's like should be so perfect. There's so much pressure in on just beans. Oh my god. It's like you know, and and in reality, you know, it's not that that shouldn't be there because it should be the truth. So no, everything should be there. Everything. It's all fucking positive signs that we're sending to each other. You know, and then it's all about like how to navigate those. You know, you're just like, ooh, ooh, ah, ah, I know this is kind of too much. This is like, ah, this is like, you know, ah, uh, uh, yeah, that looks like clothes or just something that you know you could touch, but you know, smell. And here he wants to get around, you know, it's it's nice to get around, it's, it's fucking great to be able to arouse each other. You know, because we need we need we need to drive, we need you know, we need to want to live. We need right now, there is you know, there's so many things there saying, don't leave, don't live, just uh, kill yourself or like just stay still, stay still inside your home and try to survive. <laughs> it's like, try to survive this thing because the future will be better. I mean, we have only now. <laughs> we don't know what's gonna happen. Can you imagine something even worse comes? <laughs> I mean, it's, we, we need to be, to be able to deal with that. We have like, right now, right now, right now, and that's it. And then we need to like, you know, play, play with it, because that's what we have. We have like this apparatus. We have this apparatus, this playful apparatus that can so many things. And we tend to concentrate. I can't stand the computer anymore. Like, we tend to concentrate, okay? My brain, my brain, my brain, my brain. And you know, the visual connections I can make. It's like, ah, uh, those letters on a beat for those small dots, or, you know, uh, you know, those uh, reports and those news, also news. Set. Put them aside for a while, that's you know, for myself. So happy when I do it. You know, it's like, we can, we can do so much more with our bodies and with our being and with our meetings and, you know, with everything that's there, you know, we, we have made a lot. It's 
been a crooked path. In, in, in that crooked path, jazz was born as well. I mean, if it wasn't for slavery, there would be no jazz. If you think this is like the most cruel thing to say, it's, it's how it is, you know? And like, the stuff has happened. You know, the stuff is still happening. We need to be able to deal with it, to face it, to not negate it, to not try to clean the mess as well, you know, because that won't, that won't be possible. That won't be possible to, you know, like, they, I'm just going to clean the mess at all, and it's going to be perfect. No, we know that, you know, it's not going to be perfect, but we're going to do something, we're going to do something in order to be able to include more ideas, more ways of being, more ways of of thinking, more ways of relating to each other, you know, because that's what it's all about. It's not about all the good music, the bad music, no one, is. no, you know, it's like, if you're there, you're gonna, you know, you have things that speak to yourself because you have a background, because you have a history, and so do I, you know, but I mean, what, if we give the best conditions, you know, if you like, for, for other realities to grow like right now and consent, you know, not to be a single being. Actually, I wanted to talk about something that I never did. Which was. So we're going directly in the middle of the development, taking up a phrase, putting it in at the end, developing it through a coda. It's uh, the thing, uh, you know, that often, like, I have this, so I have this, like, desires, different, maybe different desires from from what I feel around me and a certain background. And so do we all have, actually. I mean, it's like in one way or the other. We all have things we would like to, but we don't dare. So courage, courage, children, courage is really the word. It's like put your body in the situation, see what happens. Be more bodily about things. But what I wanted to say again, I come back to the phrase because it seems to be like going other places, uh, is uh, seduction again, containerization, containerization. You know, if we can use this thing of the individual, of the categories, of the fixed concepts, of the frames to something, is this, in my opinion, artistically. No, it's like here I have a bottle. It looks like a normal bottle, but there is a different message inside than the bottle itself. You know, it's like it's all about it's all about seduction and surprising. You know, because like it's a concert, it's a talk. What is it really? Like you are able to deal with the old daddies and say, of course I will do what you want. This is a package, but when you open it, surprise, surprise. So I would say yeah, that's the, that's a way to negotiate, you know, because it's all about negotiation, you know. It's like. It's all about negotiation the whole time, you know, because we're in this flow, and it's fun, actually, actually, like actually, actually, it's fun. I would, I wouldn't, I wouldn't desire otherwise. Again, desiring otherwise would be death, you know, because you know, like this is how I want, this is how it's gonna be, <laughs> and then like, well, so what? I mean, who am I in this? It's like it's a stone falling, you know. The cool thing is like when the stone falls and stuff. <laughs> in the water, I mean, why so many people like this game, for example? Oh, it's just do, 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 the stone in the water. It's like, oh, you never know how many times it's gonna, you know, bump. And sometimes longer, sometimes shorter. You know. 
this flow. So negotiate. Don't, don't be afraid to negotiate. Don't be afraid to like stand and propose things. But also like hold a little bit back on the things that you know that you're going to be a bit less unwelcome. And then when you have the opportunity, it's, it's the show is yours, you know? And then, I mean, maybe, maybe the first time you're going to compose for a symphony art, they say, no, no, I don't want to play that. No, no, that's, that's too crazy. That's too exposing, my favorite. That's too, that's, no, no, that's too ugly. Oh my god, no, no, I, I'm only being paid to be here and play music, you know, from 9 to 4, basically, and that's like, I'm gonna go home and think about it, I'm gonna go home and be sad, to be disturbed and not be able to sleep, you know, my, my wife is gonna be like, you know, mad about it and kind of like, grumpy and what's, what's happening and like, ah! So, you know, that, but, but you, we need to try to seduce people, you know, seduce people. Because what happens is, like, what happens in 99.9% of the cases, and I can tell the last 10 years I've been doing this, is that people are really happy about it. You know, they're like thanking you afterwards. Oh, that was so cool, I didn't think I could do that. done and uh, you know affect the word 
greatly the rigid thing. But now we've created this other thing which is all about fluidity and malleability, you know? Because that's what it was that's the thing we strive for again. This all and uh, so we should be able to think, okay, how how is this gonna happen? What would, what do we want to feel like, you know? Do we want to just like forget that we have like bodies and everything else and uh, you know or do we want to have that in the game as well? Forget that we're here, right here, right now, only here. This is gonna be like this now and happen only like that and you in this point of life, me. not to be a single being. Because what it is, is what people think it is. Because it actually is not. Yeah, you know. 